Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome to this video, and in this video, I'll be talking about the Gura Gura no Mi. So I have mastered Gura Gura no Mi to 100, cause you need to, to unlock all of the abilities. So, let's just go ahead and show you guys what the Edel animation is, pretty much just me just standing and using the Gura Gura no Mi. So this is what it looks like when you're just gonna go ahead just click Gura Gura, Gura, Gura no Mi and flex to everybody that you have the Devil Fruit. And let's just go ahead and pretty much go with the fighting. The basic punch, okay? This is what the animation pretty much looks like. And of course it has its own cooldown for the last and final punch. Now let's go to the first um, attack here, or the moveset, or pretty much the ability. It's called the Hypo Center Attack, so you need zero or just one mastery to get this one. So you don't need to work that hard, because you already get it once you get yourself Gur Gur No Me. So just go ahead, click E, and this is what it does. Pretty nice. Pretty nice. So what this does is pretty much just stingy here. So you can just go a little bit backwards, click E. And not only will it hit the opponent that you want to hit, but it will also hit the surrounding area, this surrounding here, wherever here. So it's like a wind thing, and it just like kicks the wind. It's like whirlwind, but on the side kind of whirlwind, not like the down one whirlwind. Now let's go to the next one, which is the helmet splitter. Click R, and that's what it does. So I would recommend you guys to have a little bit of distance like this distance right over here and then click R so that not only will you will be able to kill your one opponent but you will also be able to kill the opponents around your opponent so I would get like give a little bit more distance click R that's a perfect distance right over there so you was pretty much able to see a perfect distance you can go a little bit farther away for example you can use this if you want to attack the person that's running away from you Go ahead, click R, and just do like that. I'd be like, "Hi, I caught you," and you're pretty much happy and everything. So that's very useful for catching people that you don't like, but immediately just killing them. Now let's go to the next one, which is the this one. Oh, by the way, I completely forgot. The mastery for this one is 25. So yeah, you need to have mastery 25 to get this one. This one is a mastery of 40. It's called Earth Shaker. I really don't know what it is, but you have to click C. Okay, now I get it. So, this one is pretty useful when you're, like, grinding, I would say. Because, look here. You click C, and you put it on the... You have to put your mouse wherever you want to. And immediately killed three of them. So, that fast. So, if you don't want to go near your opponent, you can just do this. And you just kill them. That fast. No problemo. See that? No problemo. Let me see the distance, how long of a distance I need to activate it. Okay. It has to be like in front of me. So like li this kind of distance, go ahead, click C, and they're dead, pretty much. It's gonna like create a crack underneath so that they get damaged somehow. Because it's like a shaker thingy. Now going to the last and final um, ability, which is the mastery of 100. You need to master yourself to 100, which is the max mastery. So I don't, I can't see really the title or whatever. So I'm just gonna go ahead and show you guys that you need to click. Oh God. God, why are people? Oh, that was pretty neat. It just created like this thingy there. But I don't want to fight anybody yet. I'm like demonstrating here. Please go away. So, um, I used the X ability or the last ability because I was so irritated. So let's just go ahead and do this one more time. I just have to wait for the cooldown. The cooldown is going to take a long time. And by the way, do you like how I look like? I look I look pretty nice. I look pretty nice. Not the best look, but I look pretty nice. But let's just go ahead and click X again. And this is what it pretty much does. It creates this kind of whirlwind around. But you have to put wherever your mouse is or else you will just go at the top of this place and not damage anybody down here. 
So put your mouse wherever you want it to be put, click X, and then that thing. Let's try it one more time. Let's put the cooldown down more down so that we can test around with this one and see for ourselves. So I think it will fall if you put your mouse right over here, my character will go towards wherever my mouse goes. That's my guess. I don't really know. So let's just go ahead and click um, X. Nope. Oh yeah, it does. So what this pretty much does is you'll be like pretty much like it's like using up like a uh, firing like you go up and then smashes downwards so that it can hit your opponent or stuff. But I can't really demonstrate it because the damage is not that high. So I guess this is not that strong. So that is pretty much it. You can get yourself Gora if you want to. If you think that every ability here was cool and you want to flex it to people, I will not like recommend you to flex Gura because it's not literally the best um, ability to have in the game. I think it was Beerus or I don't know what was the best. Um, I don't know what the best is. Ooh, a level one flawless. But yeah, that is that for this video. Um, really, I don't. Oh, that, that's my. That's my. That's my. Uh, th that's my. That's my armor. There, he's gonna. He's. He's getting. But yes, that is that for this video. I'm. I. Uh, why are you asking me? Um. I really, really like Gura. Not the best, but still kind of like it. So, yeah, that would be it once again for this video. Because I am very satisfied with Gura. Just gonna say that. Satisfied, okay? Not the best, still satisfied though.